that's the spirit well played just go ahead and tap this in for birdie and he just keeps putting a gap on the rest of the field what a putt to hold leading by eight strokes now after that hole pretty sure this player will be buoyed by that birdie back at the last let's see if they can deliver another one That's heading for the fairway. Taking aim from about 170 yards. Opting for the five iron. Great looking shot, this. Not a bad approach. Grab the putter from the caddy. You're dancing. Oh, 13 footer coming up here. Short game has been especially sharp today, Luke. Very impressive. This one's looking good. And this puck coming up for his par. And well hold. Let's move on. John, do you have any info down there? I'm over on the 15th hole now, guys. This is Cantlay's next shot. It's a chance for a good shot here from the fairway bunker. Ooh. Gary Player couldn't play bunker shots any better than that. Let's take a look at the leaderboard as it stands. Our current leader is up by a whopping seven shots now. Let's see what happens here at the 12. What a bad line this one. Going with the eight iron here. Oh, well done. This putt coming up is for birdie. And another one goes. And with it, an increase of his lead. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. Welcome to this hole. It's a par five. What a gargantuan tee shot. Second shot here on the 13th hole. Uh, it's a brave one. Driver off the deck. Well, that's a tremendous shot and sets up a wonderful opportunity. Using the big boy muscles to get it home in two there. Oh, this is exciting. A putt for an eagle. <laughs> Terrific roll. It even had a chance. Just a simple tap in for birdie. Back to back birdies moving the right direction there, Luke. Now at 11 under for the day. All right, getting into our final stretch. Time to tee off here at the 14th. Luke. 
Hitting this player, coming off a of birdie on the last hole, getting some momentum going their direction. Anywhere up on that dance floor would be nice. That's an absolute ripper. What a shot. And there's highlights of plenty out there on the golf course. Let's take a look at this incredible shot. Here's a great shot from our player currently in second. Yes! Let's return to live play now. Just nine feet remaining to the hole. It's tracking. That's well hold. Currently in first position. Let's see what happens here on the 15th. Do you attack it and try and increase your lead, or do you lay back and play safe? I like to attack it. What do they like to do? Well played, mate. Seven feet to the cup. I like the look of this. Oh, birdie with big wings. Great putt. And nice to have that cushion heading down to the last few holes. And this is quality play. Still on top of the leaderboard. Three holes remaining, Luke. This is getting awfully fun. I shot that. That should find the surface. But not a bad approach. He'll be putting. Slim chance here for birdie, but you never know. Sitting at plus one. Currently tied for 10th place. And that shot goes in. That'll be a birdie. And that will move him up the leaderboard as well. Okay, let's get back to the action. Well, this is one of those lengthy putts. John, how do you see it? Well, it looks like about 30 feet, I'd say, to the cup. Not sure how that putt came up shy. It's downhill the entire way, and yet, inexplicably, comes up short. Well, that's a momentum maintainer. Well done. sitting at minus 14 now for the round and i don't give the rest of the field much hope today our leader is way out in front in this final round let's see what happens here at the 17th Oh, this one looks to be heading down the runway. Oh, what a wonderful play. Leading with intent. That was a thing of beauty. You got all of that one. And this effort by Justin Thomas. Wow, what a shot. A wonderful shot and a chance for Booty here on the 17th. Let's get back to it, shall we? 
Second shot here on the 17. Going with the five iron here. That's a pretty handy shot. Oh, that's outstanding. Another great shot by our leader. Dare I say, Luke, this player has been in fuego with his approach shots. Another green in regulation. Scorecard filled with threes never hurts. Good putt to make this. I like the look of this. Ooh. And tapping it in for par. And just keeping it in neutral on the leaderboard. And I don't know if the rest of the field is up for catching them here today in this final round of action. Well, what a lovely position to be in. Holding the lead, playing the last. Good luck. Second shot here on the 18th hole. Well, there's a very good reason why he's leading this tournament, and that's Exhibit A. Getting ready to play their third. What a shot! Almost went in the bucket. Oh, all that hard work, it's time to pay it off. Make this for the tournament. And in it goes, victory for our player. What a performance. Oh, absolutely. Sunday fun day. Let's go find the winner and spend the check, baby. That was an outstanding start by this player, Rich, and they've gone on to victory. What a way to win. It's very rare where you see a player absolutely dominate a field like they did in this tournament. Unbelievable job all around. Well, that just about concludes our coverage. On behalf of Rich Beam, I'm Luke Helby. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you tomorrow.
UK Sports and the PGA Tour are delighted to bring you the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. We're at the Green Hill Classic. Today's coverage is about to begin. I'm Luke Elvey with Rich Beam in the booth. And on course, we've got John McCarthy. Hello, Luke. Glad to be with you and glad to be down on the course here at the Pearl Mountain Golf Club. It's going to be a good day. From around 170 yards here. Wind back into their grill. They need to flight this one down. Going with the seven. Okay, not the best result, but a chance to get up and down. Oh, look at that. The wind just wreaking havoc with that shot. Disappointing. This would be a great up and down from this spot. Certainly makes putting easy if he can chip it that close. Gotta say, his short game is phenomenal. Starting the round at even par. Time to tee off at the second. Wow, that was just striped. Let's have a look at Billy Horschel. From the sand, looking to get up and down. Oh, you've made it. What a play. Five victories under their belt this season. Ooh, staying aggressive. Going for the green. Well, that's showcasing their power there, Rich. Using all of his muscles to get that one home in two. Putting for Eagle here. Ooh, that looks like a pure stroke. Nicely played. Moving on up the leaderboard now after that hole. Let's see what happens here at the third hole. Standing on this par four and leading. What's the strategy? What's going on through their mind? Attack it or lay back? That's a good-looking shot there. Time for the second shot into the third.
come on, get down. Yes, any time you can find the green and have a putt, you'll take it. This one's for birdie. And that should secure the par. Well done. Let's take a look at the leaderboard. He's currently tied for first. Let's see what happens here on the fourth. Come on, get a good bounce to the left. Now that looked pretty good the whole way. Outside chance here for the birdie. Just missed. And with that, you can go and put a par on the card. And after that hole, this is how the leaderboard looks. Well, it's time to head back down to the fairways. John, what's up, mate? Well, I am down on the fifth hole, and this is Sergio Garcia. Playing their fifth shot. That's the special stuff. Tough bunker shot. No bother whatsoever for this player. They find the bottom of the cup. And after that effort, this is how the field is shaping up. Here we have a par five. Is it time to get after it or play it safe? Good looking shot this. Sitting at two under, currently tied for first place. That got caught up in a few of the branches. Let's have a look at Billy Horschel from earlier. This is fourth. Well, that's a bonus. Mark that down on the card. Let's return to live play now. And here we are with the third shot. That's tiny. This putt is about 10 feet from the hole. If it's up, it could be in. Well done. Take the birdie. And with that, we'll move to three under par. And at the end of that hole, he's gone into clear outright leader. The lead is getting bigger and bigger. This hole is a par four, but it's a pretty lengthy one at that. Not sure if this one will stay on the short grass. This one from about 160 yards out. Wind is blowing left to right, gonna try and hold it against the wind. Hope it gets a good kick to the left. Yep, that one's on the dance floor. You can two-putt that for sure. Made birdie on the last. Looking for a second in a row here. This putt is about 19 feet in distance. That 
was a gallant attempt. And they'll walk away with a par on this one. Now leading by one shot. Deep into the front nine. Here we are at the seventh hole. This hole is so important at this critical time. Go for it. Lay it back. How much do you trust your swing? And this shot here coming up from around 130 yards. Straight down wind. Tough to put a lot of spin on it and hold the green. Has got this thing dialed in here, looking good. Mm, that's right out of the copy books. Exquisite. Time to take a look at what's going on at the eighth. This would be a great up and down. Go ahead and make it. Always love these opportunities, especially when it's for birdie. Not a bad line, this. And that putt will drop, and he'll extend his lead. And with that, he'll move to four under par. Doing a two-stroke lead. A couple to play here on the opening nine. Here's the tee shot at the eighth. Looks to have opted for the eight iron. This needs just a little work to the left hand side. And let's take a look at this shot from moments ago. Let's see if they manage to play a good shot out of this fairway trap. And that's another wonderful effort by the Spaniard, Sergio Garcia. OK, let's get back to the action. And this putt will take them to five under. It's got a chance. Oh, so close. Just three feet to the cup. And down it goes. And after that hole, leading Billy Horshaw by one. We've reached the ninth hole. Time to tee off. That's not the one he wanted. Setting up in the bunker here. Oh, that's a high caliber shot. Oh, this is a long way from downtown, but you're closer. John, what's he got in front of him? Well, it looks like it's about 24 feet to the cup from here. Okay, steady now. And that should secure the par. Well done. And after this hole, that's how it looks. Well, here we have it, Rich.